A growing problem after last night's deluge is now gobbling up business in Anderson Township and maybe beyond. Yeah, and we're talking about this giant sinkhole here. News News's Ellison Montoya is showing us the mess tonight and how this could create an even bigger problem. Well, it's a well known movie. A river runs through it, and that's exactly what happened to these businesses here last night. After last night's rain, this sinkhole became a raging river. And with this latest round of rain, it's getting even bigger. It's hard because this is, you love the business or you wouldn't do it. But it's hard to work this hard and then watch it all go down the drain. Barb Henry is the owner of Plants by Wolf Angle, one of the businesses affected. As she moves her knockout roses, she hopes this growing problem doesn't knock out her business. I don't know how any of this is going to get done. It's just become such an overwhelming project. Richard Shelley with Anderson Township tells us this problem started back in the fall. What has happened is the, the age of this pipe is starting to show. Uh, usually the bottom of the pipe rots out first. Uh, it's starting to fail, and it's failing in sections. Shelley says the sewage pipe catches hundreds of acres of runoff, and if this problem isn't fixed, it could take a toll on Beachmont Avenue. Ultimately, State Route 125 could uh, become underwater, and we would lose access to that uh, the use of that roadway during uh, these flooding problems. But because the drainage pipe is on private land, the business owners are the ones currently on the hook to fix it. Barb says she's letting her husband take care of that end while she takes care of her business. I've already received a lot of calls from people in the industry offering their support and their manpower, so we'll get it done. Richard Shelley tells me it's going to take hundreds of thousands of dollars to fix this big mess behind me, and the owner of Plants by Wolf Angle also mentions that her insurance isn't going to cover any of this. From Anderson Township, Allison Montoya, News 5.